Hello everybody, uh, welcome. Um, I wanted to share with you my attempt on the Ufleco uh, Dark Lager uh, clone. Uh, for those of you who don't know, uh, Ufleco is a, a very touristic uh, place, uh, uh, like a brew pub. Uh, old the classical uh, Bohemian house um, where they brew a dark lager. Uh, it's the only beer they have, but I think it's the only the oldest one in activity since uh, uh, 1499. Uh, so they, it's a very touristic place, uh, even a little bit expensive for the average uh, places in Prague uh, in, in the, the in Czech Republic. But it has the best dark lager I ever drank, and, and uh, I wanted to try a long time. I've been wanting to try it, and now this is it. I base myself on my experience. I've been there twice uh, in 2007, 2014. I read a, a recipe that uh, around in the internet. I'll drop a link below to that, and, and especially uh, Mad Fermentationist, um, his attempt. Michael's attempt on the recipe and especially his remarks and, and, and what he would do to correct it. So uh, based on all of that, um, you'll find the links uh, below, uh, also uh, for my recipe. And, and based on that, uh, I ended up with this and of course what I had around and, and what I could find. Uh, decoction, I think it's, it's a, a step they, they use there, well, uh, I figure it, I, I think it can bring uh, some complexity, some nice uh, things uh, to, to the finished product and, and um, step mash, so I, I mashed in, uh, raised to 62, then I took about one fourth, one third of the, the, the mash to a, a, a pan, um, uh, raised it to 67, it was difficult to, 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 to keep up the temperature for about 20 minutes and then I cooked, I boiled the, the, the grains uh, for about 25-30 minutes. Meanwhile I raised the, the, the rest in the grain father to 69. Uh, I put the two together for an extra 10 minutes at 69 degrees and then raised for a mash out uh, 10 minutes, uh, ended up to, to, to stay about 15 minutes at um, 75. I ended up uh, like uh, three points, uh, four points above, below uh, the expected uh, original gravity. It's not a problem. Uh, the, the 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 biggest uh, issue here is uh, the recipe itself, flavor. If I end up like instead of 5.1 or 5.2, 4.8, it's not uh, that uh, big deal. Uh, fermentation. I will try for the first time the the Brulosophy, uh lager. Technique. I'll, uh, for those of you who don't know, I'll drop a link below uh, to, to that also and see what do I get. Uh, I'll use the M M84 Bohemian Lager from Mangrove Jacks. I, uh, I, I tried it uh, before, it's a great, uh, I ended up, the, 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 gave me the, the best uh, Hellas I've brewed and uh, it's a very nice uh, yeast. We'll see what we get um i'll promise uh, where within a few months to 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 come back here and to show you the finished product and uh, i hope i get a, a really nice uh, dark lager uh, that i will enjoy a lot drinking uh, with food and and uh, it, it's a very um easy beer um for me especially in this colder seasons and this was it guys i hope you enjoyed it see you next time cheers